Here at the Pacific Northwest National Laboratory, we perform trace detection research to enhance the detection of explosives. This demonstration will illustrate a groundbreaking revolutionary discovery that will change the way we do screening for explosive threats. We have developed the capability to do direct, real-time detection of explosive vapor from low-volatility explosives. This capability will greatly enhance the ability to screen people, baggage, and cargo for explosives. This is a demonstration of the real-time vapor detection capability developed here at PNNL. This is an ionization source built at PNNL for the selective ionization of explosive compounds. This is a reaction tube which provides a longer residence time and enables enhanced vapor detection of explosives. This is a commercial mass spectrometer and the interface of the ionization source with the reaction tube to the mass spectrometer will enable the rapid commercialization of this technology. This is a glass microscope slide with no sample on it. Here we sample the vapor coming off the slide and as a blank you see no response for either the RDX and PETN on the left hand side or PETN on the right hand side of the screen. Here is a similar glass slide that was spiked with about 5 micrograms of RDX over a year ago. When we sample the vapor coming off the glass slide, we see the response to RDX on the left side of the screen, but no PETN response on the right. This is another glass microscope slide, now with the residue of PETN on the surface. When we sample the vapor from the PETN slide, we see a response for the PETN on the right side of the screen. C4 is a plastic explosive that contains predominantly RDX, and this is a vial containing C4. You can see the RDX response coming off of the C4 out of this vial. Direct, real-time vapor detection represents a scientific advancement that has long been desired for security purposes. This core discovery is a major breakthrough in explosives detection technology.